Mitten University is an amazing place. I've only been there once, just went for the afternoon. It's pretty confusing though, there are so many different colleges and buildings. I was lost in its winding corridors and cavernous libraries for several days. It was a haunting experience, but I must say, very picturesque. There's a fly in here. You're listening to Ricky Hawthorne on Two Point Radio. You're listening to Two Point Radio. This is Ricky Hawthorne. It's a few minutes past something. We'll check on those numbers while you listen to some music. Unattended sandwiches will be eaten by me.
filters should be checked in and then removed immediately. are reminded to have the time of their lives. It's funny how your routines can change after all these years. Lately, I've been enjoying a bowl of hog logs in the morning. It's true what they say in the advert. That just wasn't enough pig in my morning. This next song is for the hog log lady. Now taking students for robotics.
Recently, while walking home, I was chased into a tree by a group of students barking like dogs. I went into a primal state of self-preservation, hissing at them like a feral cat. I've learned since that it was some kind of initiation for a society. Oh, I suppose now that I know it was a joke, I can see the funny side. Ha, young people, eh? The terrifying scamps. It doesn't matter how desperate you are. No urinating on campus facilities. are reminded that there's no such thing as free time. You want to make stacks of easy cash, but reading about stocks is really boring.
Invest in BungleCoin. It's like other fictional cryptocurrency, but with 40% less saturated fat. It doesn't matter how desperate you are. No urinating on campus facilities.
You're listening to Ricky Hawthorne on Two Point Radio. Here's the weather. Things are looking cold on the pointy mountains. You might want to wear a second pair of shoes. I suppose skis are technically a second pair of shoes. What they lack in terms of providing warmth, they make up for by being a lot like very thin toboggans. Play that music. Janitor needed in dormitory. belief system. I recently joined an amateur plumbing club. Oh, it's a lot of fun. The pipes, the tools, the rush when you blow a valve. The competitive element is one thing, but it's also great training for when something goes wrong at home. After all, with the right attitude and a little experience, there's no problem you can't make worse. We've just completed a research project. Well done.
the news today, pop star Jasmine Odyssey has everybody talking after sharing an image of a spatula. Fans are debating whether this latest post is a cryptic suggestion of music to come or simply a kitchen-based mistake. It's hard to say, but what is clear is that we'll be discussing it for days. Asked questions. No, I will not be your friend. Congratulations. Research project complete.
advice, the longer you've been revising. That's the end of our show, but I'll be back tomorrow to do it all over again. Here's to that. Here's to time's relentless advance. Here's to you, Two Point County. Playing this out, we've got an absolute firecracker. Good night. Frequently asked questions. Your food is cold because the oven wasn't on. Security breach. Please change your passwords. Sorry. are reminded to be in two places at once.
just completed a research project. Well done. Sir Nigel Bickleworth on Two Point Radio. I hear that another university has opened its doors to the aspiring bookworms and lab rats of Two Point County. Listeners may remember that I don't like new universities because they're not old and therefore not any good. If they were, they'd have opened a long time ago. That's called logic, students. Though I don't suppose you'd know. Janitor needed in research lab. End of year is approaching. It's too late to start trying.
Welcome back. I can't say that I understand our county's recent fascination with opening pop-up universities on a weekly basis, but it seems appropriate to commemorate the opening of yet another fun-time house of real good learning. I thought we'd talk about the past, memories, and nostalgia. The feelings that things used to be in some incalculable and all-encompassing sense better. But why do we feel that way? Are we rearing rose-tinted glasses? Perhaps. Did everything used to be better? Probably. Showering is technically but not socially optional. The academic year is starting. I hope you have a pencil. Taking students for Scientography. You students should make a good first impression. No pressure. Administrative bonuses. Questions. No, I've not seen your frog.
I used to love taking the train, the steam, the crisp sandwiches, watching people's luggage fall. Oh, those were the days. Sadly, I now find the experience of using our county's rail services is missing one rather vital component. I find that everyone seems all too engrossed by their mobile phones. Now, I have no interest in talking to anyone, but what I did like was ignoring people. It's just no fun if they do it for you. Students are reminded that you came here on purpose. Schoolwork. Moron. Social life. Loser. Exercise. Coward. I just can't do it all. There's only one way to fit everything in. Make your life jumbo. Jumbo University. Be your biggest self.
students are reminded that this is the fun part. I was recently stolen back to the days of my youth. Yes, after inadvertently trapping myself in the airing cupboard, what did I come across but my old wooden tennis clogs? It had been too long since I thought about my days on the university tennis team. It was said that the mere sound of our carved shoes were enough to cause eruptions of rosy cheeks and giggling on campus. Although some believed that it had something to do with our shorts. Hmm. If you hear this, please drink some water. Thank you. are expensive and education is priceless. happened to wooden tennis shoes anyway? The visual spectacle of tennis used to be accompanied by a positive symphony. A sound like a company of coconuts dancing on a ballroom floor. Only wooden tennis clogs can produce such an enchanting auditory experience. But what do they wear now? Ghastly squeaky things. And for what? Added grip? Light weight? It's practically cheating. Education is non-refundable.
We're sorry for the litter that you... Oh, sorry, that's mine. Staff are reminded to care about students. The rise of the synthetic shoe is not confined to the tennis court, sadly. I'm sure many long-time listeners know that I visit Confetto's Cobblers once a year and treat myself to a pair of brogues or loafers if I'm feeling scandalous. On my most recent visit, however, I was horrified to find that my dear cobbler had been replaced with an establishment by the name of the Shoe Zoo. But can one truly describe their collection of footwear as a menagerie without possessing a single pair of brogues? I think not. Janitor required for groundskeeping. Thank you. are reminded that some grades are personal.
Remember the start of the show? Remember when we were going to talk about nostalgia? Oh, what a paradise it seems. And yet, here we stand, talking about trading shoes. Another vision gone awry over the savage passing of time. <gasps> How fitting. How dreadfully sad. Things used to be better, dear listeners. How could you know for sure? Well, my show is over. They can't be getting better, can they? Frequently asked questions. Yes, we are testing you. this. Students are reminded that you don't have to ask to go to the toilet.
Lots of students struggle to get enough sleep. That's why Campus Radio's very own Maggie Watmore has been trying out the latest techniques to fit some much needed rest into a busy schedule. Right, I've been trying out power napping, the day's craze sweeping through campus like that fungus in the showers. For those of you that don't know, power napping, or turbo kipping, is a practice that allows you to sleep on the spot, grabbing some valuable rest time between classes. I think I almost did it for a moment, but then I realised I was 45 minutes late for a lecture. <laughs> but no, yeah, I actually feel really well rested. The yearly results are in. Wow.